Welcome to Quad Tech. This video tour of our high tech center is just a glimpse of what we've got going on here. Someday, we'd love to have you come visit us in person. Come on, let's go take a look. This is our international headquarters in Sussex, Wisconsin. Here we do the majority of our engineering. We've got a vast range of different engineering talent within our organization. Everything from applied mathematicians, optics experts, software mechanical engineers, electrical engineers, and so forth. Our business is separated into three different operating units. One unit focuses specifically on our packaging clients. The second unit focuses specifically on our commercial and newspaper uh, client base. And our third is focused on our parent company, Quad Graphics, and all the applications that they have for automation. That engineering expertise has helped Quad Graphics become one of the largest and most technologically advanced printers in the world. We're here at, across the street from the High Tech Center visiting one of Quad Graphics' largest printing facilities. We like to refer to it as our laboratory. While you may think this isn't applicable to you, I believe it demonstrates our engineering expertise and the varying ways we can use this expertise across all industries that we serve. From something as large and complex as a folder to something as small and precise as our camera technology. So how did we get started? Back in 1979, our parent company, Quad Graphics, was just a very small printer uh, getting started in the industry. And they had a lot of different uh, opportunities they saw for automation, but no one to really turn to to provide that to them. So at that time, our founder, Harry Kodrachi, and his brother, Tom Kodrachi, started a group called Quad Tech with just a couple of engineers that has now grown into a multinational company that supplies product to, to uh, customers in over 105 countries. Now we're at our clean room, which we like to refer to as the birthplace of our SpectroCam and AccuCam. As you can see behind, we've got a couple of our uh, technicians busy uh, assembling cameras. And this clean room is a pressurized uh, environment that uh, allows us to build the cameras in a dust-free environment, which is important when you're building precision equipment. One of the ways that we feel we've separated ourselves from our competition is the fact that we develop our cameras specifically for the applications that they're going into. We do not take an off-the-shelf camera and write custom software to make it perform as best as that camera technology will, will uh, allow. Instead, we go and develop the camera technology necessary to meet the application, the speeds that are required for that application, and the environment that we're putting the camera into. The unit in the back of the room here is our calibration and validation uh, stand. Every one of the cameras that's built in our clean room environment goes through this as its last step before it being delivered to a customer. If it does not pass all its calibration and validation standards to the BCRA tiles uh, built into the stand, it is not allowed to leave our door and be shipped to a customer. Behind me, we have part of our manufacturing area. What I typically hear from clients when they visit us for the first time is that they had no idea of the size or the breadth of scope of manufacturing that we do here at Quad Tech. Back in 2002, we started employing lean manufacturing processes in our manufacturing area. So why should you care? Through the efforts of our team on the manufacturing floor, we've been able to reduce our lead times by 70% of what we previously had done several years ago. As I've stated from the very beginning in 2002, lean is really a journey and not a destination. While we've made some great inroads over the past nine years, we feel every day our, our employees continue to bring more and more innovation to our manufacturing process.